Hi, this is Eric with Parts Doctor, and today we're going to show you how to replace the lower freezer drawer glide on your GE refrigerator. If you need to purchase a new drawer glide for your refrigerator, check out our website, partsdoctor.com, where we sell parts for all major appliance brands. Start by opening the freezer door, then pull the upper drawer forward and tilt it up and out. Remove the lower drawer by pushing it back slightly, then tilt the front up and out. Then, using a 3 8 inch nut driver, remove these six screws. Tilt the door forward and lift up and out. Slide the pinion shaft to the right, removing it from the left hand pinion gear. Then remove the shaft from the other gear. Using a quarter inch nut driver, remove the two bolts holding the slide bracket in place, then lift up and out. With a flathead screwdriver, gently pry the pinion gear away from the drawer glide. Then using a T20 Torx bit, remove the two screws holding the drawer glide in place. Depress the retaining tab and pull the glide away from the slide holder. If you need to purchase a new lower drawer glide, you can check out our website, partsdoctor.com. We'll leave a link in the description below. You want to make sure you are searching with the model number from the tag on your refrigerator to make sure you are getting the correct part. To install, slide the drawer glide into the holder until it snaps into place, and then reinstall the screws. Reinstall the pinion gear by fully extending the drawer glide, aligning the gear with the tab facing down and snapping it back into place. It is important to ensure the glides are fully extended or the gear may not align properly. Align the tabs on the slide bracket to the retainers on the rail and set into place, then reinstall the screws. Insert the pinion shaft into the right hand gear as far as it will go. Then align it to the left hand gear, insert and slide into place. To make installing the door easier, insert a small object onto the pinion wheel track to jam the gear so that the slide brackets stay in place. Then align the tabs on the door brackets to the retainers on the slide rails and gently set in place. Reinstall the screws. To install the lower drawer, insert it at an angle, making sure it sits beneath the support glide. Then pull the drawer forward so that the tabs align with the retainers on the slide rails. Make sure that the front of the basket is beneath the lip. To install the upper drawer, align the rear guide wheels on the drawer to the top of the support glide rail in the freezer compartment. That's it for today's video, and if you found this video helpful, please leave a like and comment down below. And for more videos like this, please consider subscribing.